is a wheel that I've created, which is really just um, two tables, really. It's a verb table hidden underneath, and then there's a, uh, a table of prepositional pronouns, which if you see, um, you know, all together in one place on a page can sometimes look a bit daunting. And there's no new information here. This information's all been available um, in the back of trusty old first lessons in Manx, um, you know, since for over a hundred years since Goodwin put it together. So it's all been available in one place before now. Um, but I have created this wheel. So the rest of the table is covered while you're not looking at the bits that you don't need to see, which is a bit easier on the eye. Um, I'm dyslexic and when I started learning Manx, it's probably one of the first um, academic -y things that I've done since leaving school. And um, I've always had to come up with new learning strategies um, for myself, especially when it's to do with the written word. And I have always found colour and using colour and very helpful in isolating the particular word that I want to look at and um, so it's not jumping about all over the page or so I'm not getting words from the sentence below where I'm trying to read and so I find covering the information that I don't need really helpful and I find that um, putting things in colour really helpful as well because I can think oh that's where the purple one always goes so it must be an it's a really easy kind of uh, peg to hang that knowledge on as well. So that, that's why I created it. I did actually only make it for myself and um, originally it was just handwritten and quite scruffy and I had it at um, a Manx conversational group that I went to and the Manx class that I used to go to and I was sh showing it to a couple of people and the lovely late Leslie Farragher was really taken by it and he was like, oh, that's great, um, could you photocopy it? And I said, oh yeah, if, if you think you'll find it useful. Um, but my writing isn't the neatest and obviously you can read your own writing much better than you can read other people's writing. So I um, thought, well, I'll type it up. And so Leslie was really the, the kind of kickstart for, for doing it. So other people could use it really, typed out. So this version looks really fancy, I, I love it. Um, obviously I've made the original ones myself, first they were handwritten and then they were just on laminated paper that I'd done myself on Adobe Illustrator, I don't pretend to be a graphic designer at all. And um, a good friend suggested to uh, the Grenada that um, other people might find them useful as well and perhaps they could produce them so I gave all of the files to Culture Fan and they've done a brilliant job at um, putting them together and there's no longer my raggedy cutting out there it's all done nicely with a little brass pin in the middle and you can buy them from Culture Fan for only five pounds which I think is a bargain so. Mm -hmm.